The only things you need to know about Miles is if he's not dancing, he's either working out or producing music. He can sing, he can dance, he can act. He's muscular. Um. <laughs> Every day he motivates me to be the best person that I can be. The prima ballerino himself, Miles Early! This tour was a dream turned into reality. Miles is extremely talented. I admire his work ethic. Even when we're on the road, he knows what he needs to do. He truly is a triple threat. He can sing, dance, act. He has great hair, really great hair. Miles, I would say, is like a broccoli. Because, you know, like his hair is done at the top, but then, you know, like it comes down, it's all defined at the bottom. It's kind of buff and stuff. Being backstage, getting ready to go on for that very first number was just like something I cannot explain. The lights would go down from the audience. I'd run on and do my first big flip and the crowd would just go crazy. That part never ever got old for me. I don't think it will ever get old for me. <laughs> oh I don't know. Is Miles into fitness? Whoa, what are you doing, bro? Did you just get here? Yeah, man. That was like a 14 hour drive, man. Fasty run, you know? What? Hey, bro, I'll see you inside. Actually, thanks, bro. Miles is overly into fitness. He's actually gone above and beyond the bar. It's always good to be that dedicated into fitness, but you know, I, I've said to him before, there's gotta be, you gotta have your moments where you just let loose, you know? like. Have a piece of cake. Well, ever since I was a little kid, I've always been into sports, you know, fitness, and obviously dancing. It's a bonus for my training with dance. I mean, dance is so active, and you need to be very healthy, and you need to be very physical, and fitness fits in perfectly with that. I decided in Europe, I needed to take my training to the next level. Go time, let's do this. I wanted to be able to train with the pro Italian boxers. That's hometown for me, I'm half Italian, so doing that was something I will never forget. I've actually always loved boxing and kickboxing and stuff because that training is so incredibly hard. I mean, the respect I have for those guys that train in that every day is unbelievable. In the warm-up, I was already done. They have to have an extreme amount of cardio to be able to keep going. And that's the same with dancing, doing a, a five-minute dance number. You have to be able to keep it up the whole time. If this was me, I would be dead all the time, for sure. So kudos to all of them for getting to this class. <laughs> And I was like 20 minutes in, and um, right then and there, I realized how intense these guys are and how intense this whole lesson is going to be. It was so funny. I was laughing so hard. <laughs> I mean, it's a lot of cardio, so <laughs> I would be watching and I'd look over and he's like, <laughs> going so hard. I actually got to spar with one of the boxers. I'm feeling good. I'm about to get my, my butt kicked in. <laughs> it's all good though, it's all good. I was a little nervous. I mean, I had never actually sparred before, and especially sparring with an Italian champion. So I was like, what am I doing? What am I doing right now? I can't believe I'm even getting into this ring. He 
definitely, you know, played around with me a little bit. He was going extremely easy, but I was giving my all. I couldn't even breathe. I was just trying to keep up. Come on! Once he started actually punching, he got so tired. It was so cute. He'd be like punching, punching, punching in the face, and then he would stop for a second and get a punch right back. Something I really took away was how serious and determined their training was to them. I saw that and I was like, that is so cool because I feel the same way about my dancing and my training. You guys, are, you guys are insane. He beat me though. <laughs> that was great. It was a lot of fun. Italian boxing. <laughs> Being on tour with, with the cast was, it was amazing. I mean, everyone's so cool and the fans were incredible. I would feel it in my heart every time. Seeing that with my own eyes was incredible. And I will never forget that. <laughs>